and I'll come back home. This is a very, very quick video for now. I just want to show now some kind of very interesting tips and websites. Maybe say I didn't use the make client website. Maybe say if I make um I know they to stress myself with this whole process. Most of the links go there inside the description of the video. So if now they like this kind of content, make sure to check out the other videos where you get for this channel. So if now your first time when they come here, it's for this channel. Eh? Now what do they do for here? We say we they talk about code, we talk about technology, all those kind of things. We they talk about what they do have for pitching. Now, what you want to do for here? Say, you won't come this site. This is now the first site where I go recommend. This is now on Splash. So on Splash now, where you go to find pictures and where you find your images for your client's websites. If you come here, if you just search for any picture where you want, and you go use them. So you get some kind of other ones. Sometimes on Splash, you know they get all the pictures where they want. So you get one where they always save my hash, and then at this one, they call them um, pixels. And these pixels, eh? What did they do? Be say it be the same, but it they. I want to talk about a day more free, like a day more interesting to the work with. So they get more pictures pass on splash and on splash. It just like I said, they just started to collect money say, for some of their pictures. But um Pexels now say you go to get very clean pictures, also just like on splash, but it get more as far as I can tell that they help me most of the time. Another site where I would like to recommend now uh, this one, Pixel Bay. Pixel Bay in our site will be say a day like the rest of them, but they get a lot of these vector or digital images. So all these kind of images, some of them are real, some of them are video. Of course, and for Pixel Bay also, we really get videos for here for um Pixel Bay also. So if you just come here and you go choose which of them you want. So you see, say for the search bar, if you search for anything, if you search for picture, illustration, um, vector, video, music, sounds, gifs, and or anything where they find our users. For Pexel, you could just come um, if you're on videos, you click videos and it will give you the videos of any of them where you want. And uh, on Splash, what on Splash they do, they say on Splash they give us all this um, mainly for for pictures. But I don't know if they, they do videos. If they, they do videos, I'll be making to let me know. And also, if you don't know any other one way better pass all these other sites, I'll be making to let me know. So if you get some of these pictures, another thing you gonna need, be say sometimes you go like to overlay your pictures on top of one another and your client site. For example, if you know they work, like make we say you get you want to put this yellow um, stuff on top of your client website and the background now now another color and you want to use them. So how you go take down? You don't like this yellow background, but you like this picture. Well, what you gonna need to do now? Remove background and then now why they use this tool? You come this site remove dot bg. This remove dot bg. What did they do? We say they help us convert the background for free. We by ourselves before. Wait till they do be say I did done by myself for all this Photoshop and all those things. But with this site, I know they remove background by myself anymore. So you know they had. I could just carry any picture here. I could remove the background anyhow I want. For example, make we come use this image where we just show for here. And then what I could do be say I could just open the image for another screen. Just so I go fish show now. And then I will show you how the thing they remove the background for the screen. So if you come here and then I just paste in the link for here, it go come out to the background for the image. You just see say so now. It don't come out that yellow background. So if I can't export the image or if I can't download the image, I feel download them as HD, I feel download them as normal one. So if I can't download them, it will constantly say I feel change the background of anything. So I feel even add design, I feel edit them, I feel do anything I want, I feel put them on top of any background, I feel do you know anything with this site and the site it go work for me nice, nice. I feel add another background image on top of them, I feel move this around, I feel change the color. All these things I feel do for the site, or I feel just even download them, upload them for Figma, and do anything I want with this image. So, this is a very nice trick where we say you're going to use so they get this quality for your client's website. Another very interesting one now, this one with the column convert case. So, this convert case, as simple as it be here, what did they do? We say it they help me they arrange the text very, very nice. It they help me they set the text. We say if the text no sure, like for example, if I say, uh, if I say I'm like this now and I write this text, you're going to notice say I put this one for uppercase, I put this one say for uppercase, but I put some of the text here as capital letter and some for small letter and all those kind of things. So what they decide they help me, they do be say, I they quickly, they change the case of the text. So if I want to make na sentence case, meaning say na just this one for here, I could just come the sentence case and go change everything here to sentence case. Also, if you even set them to capitalize, if you change them to anything where you want, title case and so forth. Another very interesting one where I like now this site with the color name legs. And what's in name legs they help me they do? They say they help me they generate name of company. 
because sometimes you go on just generate name of company or get idea of logo or all these kind of things now that time we had they like use this name like so for example make you say we didn't want to make a um, web design company right so if you just say uh, web design so if i talk on like this now what's the name like could do be say once i click generate it will help me generate it will ask me some kind of things say make i just fill out this small random form and if i click here any of them and then i just say i could choose how i want to make the name be make it be from um, spelled or make it be compound or make it be two words or things like that so i could just say okay make the word just be short word and then make it just make i just click next for here and then make i just say how i want to make the words they random make i just say make it a balance for here and then we we'll go click next and as we click this next make we say the brand we want to represent now this web design okay then our own brand so if you say oh okay this is not the idea where we get and if you talk any kind of description where we want so we could just say and if we talk out like this and we press next you will see say name legs will just generate it will quickly generate a name for me based on what in i type so for example if you just give me all these names for here if you give me this web glow design and uh, hype city so all these names here you go config scroll by the way this list here it be like say this list not a finish because what they do be say it go to give us all sorts of names and it give us for different ideas so if you blend these names here or if you use them to take get how we want to make our own uh logo or or our own logo or our own even company name so that's why i did like use um all these kind of tools like uh, name legs so they get all those company names just to get idea i don't need to use the main thing now you, um if you want click any of these ones if you get even the domains for here so if you just register any of the domains for here if you come here say okay you like this um art of design i like them if i click art of design for here go kind me go this page and for here I go feel say oh okay if you take more names for here if you do more designs for here as i want so now nah, so i did take do this one for here so finally make we see any word any word now one of my favorite ones because what did they do be say any word they help me they generate the kind thing what i want like any word they help me they use ai and it they give me the text where i want so if i want to get content for a whole website now and I don't know where I want to get this content for my clients because some clients, if you just call, you say, I want websites and this site, they don't go give you content. They don't go give you anything where you go, right? They go just say, say, now my business with this, make this website for me. Now, because you don't know what's in the one, right? You could just go make one rubbish site. But if you want to say, if you know, say, oh, okay, your clients now, uh, with now uh, plumber, you come this site. If you can say, make this site, can't tell you something about plumbers, and then you go copy all the things. Where this side they give you about plumbers, you can they you know modify them, they make them your, and then you go put them for inside this your own uh client website where they work with. So then I'm waiting um any word for here they help me they do. So it they free somehow, but you know they free somehow. Okay, so just now so they use them because some some part of them they free, and uh, if you use them past one month. You go get some things, you go get some kind of restrictions where you don't go feel make again. So keep that in mind. But for now, that's not all where we go fit length. If you they enjoy this kind of video, I beg make them let me know. If you get suggestion, you feel also let me know for the comment side of this video. And they always they try and reply. But if you now want to hear me directly, no wala now. If you join our telegram community. Otherwise, thanks for watching. Oh.